So I guess, you know, really what I saw was that, uh, you know, we, we failed to get a couple of big hits. They got a couple of big hits. Uh, they put together a full run inning. Uh, we need to, we need to somehow find a way to get out of that inning, maybe only giving up two um, and just, uh, you know, do a better job. Uh, we got a guy, we got a guy get picked off in the first inning on nothing, nothing on. Uh, that was frustrating. That's got a chance to score a run, grab the lead, maybe a little momentum. Uh, who knows what kind of inning we had there? I know we scored a couple, but uh, we might have had a real big inning. And uh, just just some of the little things, you know, we we had a first baseman cut a ball off that looks like it's going to throw somebody out of the plate. Um, no one said a word about relay the ball. Nobody said relay, and then he throws it away. And that was the frustrating things. It's just the, it's just the little things that uh, you know that who knows where that game would have been. They had a one run lead. The ball gets to the catcher, tags him out. You know, we we may be rolling there. That's a double play, and they only have one in. So, uh, you know, we got to do a better job of uh, uh, producing some runs when we have opportunities. We created a couple innings, and then we didn't come through. So, uh, give credit to them. They just they just played better than us today, and they deserve to win. You mentioned the the pickoff and the the cutoff. Uh, are those like little things that you think are just opening weekend type things that are going to get corrected, or is this something you've seen? Well, they, they have to get corrected. I mean, you. Those are just, you know, you practice one way and you have communication and verbals and different things on cutoffs and relays, and that's what you got to go with, whether it's right or wrong. Um, you know, if, yeah, I mean, they've, they've got to get corrected. How do you get picked off first base with, with nobody out after you just double? Just little things that, that can't happen at this level. What you think of Mason Molina's start today? I thought he threw the ball pretty good. Um, you know, he, his pitch count got up a little bit and got behind. And when he got behind, you know, that's when they got the big hits. And, uh, you know, I was hoping he would go five innings. He went, I think, three and two-thirds. And, uh, you know, it had been nice to, to get some more – another inning and a third out of him anyway. But, uh, you know, they you got to give them credit. They fouled off a lot of pitches. They're hard to strike out. And uh, – you know that's 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 what uh, really happened with with Mason and his pitch count. They just they fought him. Vogaski just kept going out there and throwing well. What was it that he was doing to give you guys trouble? Well, he's got good stuff. He's he's their best guy. You know, I mean, he's he kind of throws a, a high carry fastball. It stays on plane. He's got a good breaking ball, and uh, I mean, he threw a lot of pitches and. Uh, you know, they were they were trying to get to a point yesterday where they could get him in. Obviously, Friday they wanted to have a chance to win the game, tie game, and uh, when they had that opportunity today, they jumped on it, and then he held us down while they put together a good inning. So, um, just he's good. And then Nolan Souza, first start, really hit a few balls hard. What do you think about him? Yeah, I mean, his first at bat, I think he lined out. Second bat, I think he. I don't know if he got a hit or what, but uh, I, I know that I know that he swung the bat good, and you know I felt good about the way he competed up there, and uh, well, it's a good good first first outing for him. Uh, third different guy starting in left this you know this weekend with Lovich. Just what have you seen from from all three, and you know is that a competition that could go kind of deep into the middle of the season? Yeah, it's a it's a position that you know if you can run and catch it, you got to hit. You got to hit when you play corner outfield. So, um, yeah, I think it's it'll be one of those situations it's wide open until somebody somebody takes control of it, or it'll be a matchup position where you go left against right hander and vice versa. You had the pick off early, but a couple of guys getting thrown out, maybe being aggressive. You you happy with that that uh, kind of that aggression? Yeah, or I mean the double, you know, Lowich trying to get get. You know, get to second base on that play. I didn't have a problem with that at all. You know, made the outfielder make a play, and he made a perfect throw. Um, so, you know, hats off to them. And you know, it happens. It's uh, sometimes you got to you got to take a chance here and there. And it was early in the game. I think we had a two nothing lead at the time, maybe. And nah, I don't blame him at all for that. I don't. You know, some of the other stuff that got thrown out stealing on a, you know, when maybe maybe the steal sign wasn't on. That's frustrating. Um, 
but but we're gonna we're gonna play aggressive in certain situations. Now that was a good time for that. Seemed like pretty much every reliever you brought in pretty much did their job for the most part. Just kind of blew up in that one inning. What'd you make of each of the performances of Gackle, Fouch, and Verity? And I guess yeah, I mean you think about you know, start out with Hewlett came in and left on left got him out or whatever. They made a pinch hit and you know he had to go go for the right hander and he still got him out. Really threw a really nice. I think it might have been a change up to get him. And then uh, you know Gackle's first outing, throwing strikes for the most part and and just thought he threw the ball well. You know they. Uh, they they start they start getting on his fastball a little bit because he got behind the count. That's when they got their hits. And Verity can brought him in in a worse situation. Base load, I think maybe no outs. And you know he really made a good pitch. He jammed their hitter and he just hit it through the middle. If he gets it a little bit one way or the other, it's right at one of our guys. But you know, give him credit, he found a way to. He got the barrel on it, but it was more towards the middle. Um, but Verity, I thought he did a good job. And McGuire, you know. Just got a little wild. He just couldn't finish him off. He'd get to one, two, and next thing you know, it was three, two, foul ball, ball four, and we had to go get him. And, uh, you know, Fouch came in and did a pretty good job. He just got behind the count with a three, one. A guy hits one 450 feet and just stood there and watched it. And, uh, you know, that's that, that's good hitting. When, you, when they make a mistake, you hammer it. In terms of pitching tomorrow, how good do you feel about the arms you have left and kind of who can go for you? Yeah, we got four or five guys left. Um, Bobby's not available. He's been sick. So, uh, you know, starting a young pitcher and, you know, we, we'll just see how it goes for him. And then we'll, we'll go to the next man. Coach, thank you for your time. Okay.